I don't know about you, but I could use some morning joy. I could use it all the time, right? <laughs> right? <laughs> joy Wang is back with us this morning. And Joy, you're talking about the weekend. <laughs> Yup, and just in time for the weekend, the artist has dropped his new album, Dawn FM. We definitely have a lot of his fans here in the studio, and so I've always wanted to say this, ladies and gentlemen, the weekend. I know his life is chaos, but he made one thing true. You gotta unwind your mind, train your soul to align, and dance till you find that divine. That album has already reached number one on U.S. Apple Music, and it's got a lot of people involved, even Jim Carrey. She being very Asian, and I don't know, uh, she can keep her Korean um, to herself. By now, you've probably seen this viral video of St. Louis anchor Michelle Lee getting a voicemail from someone offended. She mentioned eating dumplings for New Year's. Well, she posted the video on Twitter, and the internet responded, including journalists from across the country, even celebrities, all using the hashtag VeryAsian, many even taking pictures of the dumplings they've been eating to show some pride. Now, there's even merchandise where proceeds will go to the Asian American Journalists Association. This nasty voicemail has led to an important conversation about representation. I actually just put in my order yesterday for a very Asian sweater. Excited to get it in the mail. And let's switch gears now to how do you decide how you want to watch something on Netflix? I know that top 10 list or what's trending can really help me make a decision. But get this, according to reviews.org, Coco Melon actually took the first spot for top 10 TV shows of the year, with Manifest in second and the very popular Squid Game coming in third. By the way, the top movie of the year was The Secret Life of Pets 2, and I know nothing about Coco Melon, yeah. but Colton, you said I'm it's an a expert fan favorite. in Coco Melon <laughs> and the songs now, and I can't stand it. It drives me crazy that it's on the top 10 every time. All the time, right? Because I'm like scrolling through the top 10, I'm like, ugh. Yeah, and it, when you turn <laughs> it's on a Netflix, waste of a spot. 